मणिपाल अकाडमी आफ् हयर् एजुकेशन महे वत स्वातंत्र उत्सव देशभक्त भावने आचरल महे प्रोफेसर चांसल डॉक्टर एच एस बल्ला तुकड़ी पथ संचल वीक्षी गौरव वंदन स्वीक ध्वजारोहण नेरवे महे उपकुलपति लेफ्टिनेंट जनरल डॉक्टर एम डि वेकटेश स्वातंत्रोत्सव सदेश शिक्षण आर्थिकते मूल सौकर्य विज्ञान तंत्रज्ञान सेर विविध क्षेत्र भारत साधन पट्टा ब्रिटिश साम्राज्य स्वातंत्र पड़ी नम पूर्वज स्मरी प्रजाप्रभुत्व के निर्णायक गडी रक्षा शाश्वत शांत खातरीपड़ी नम सैनिक पात्र श्लाघ माह प्रोफेसर वैस चांसल रिजिस्टर विविध घटक मुख्यस्थ विविध विभाग मुख्यस्थर अधिकारी अध्यापक व्यार्थी माह सदस्य सीरदे माह उन्नत आडल मंडलिया अधिकारी कार्यक्रम उपस्थितर डॉक्टर सतीश राव स्वगत डॉक्टर पद्मलता एन रई धन्यवाद सलू सदी मल्य कार्यक्रम निर्वह अत्यम कवायत प्रदर्शन तक बहुमान कूड़ा सदर्भली वितरल of India's 77th Independence Day. As we celebrate this milestone in our nation's journey at the splendid venue of Mahe Manipal, as a colleague here, I extend a warm welcome to you. We also extend.
Thank you, sir. For great. Captain and Colonel Adams Rawat, Adam Officer, NECC Battalion, OPD. Major Tanima, Key Accounts Manager, Solo Space. Very, very warm greetings to all of you on the 77th Independence Day of our country, being celebrated with great pomp and grandeur all over the country. Mahe is equally enthusiastic in the celebration of our independence during his Amrit Khan with a vision of India to become a developed country by 2047 when we celebrate 100 years of our independence. Ladies and gentlemen, we are right on track for this ambitious yet eminently achievable milestone. As we celebrate our 76-year-old independence, it is important to remember the sacrifices of thousands of our freedom fighters who fought for this coveted independence, freeing us from the British rule. Many have made the supreme sacrifice of laying down their life. It is important for us today to remember them, to thank them, to salute them. Even after independence, our armed forces and the paramilitary personnel have rendered yeoman service in protecting our borders during war and peace, fighting internal strife, insurgency, maintaining peace and harmony, and have served in the UN peacekeeping forces across many countries for the global peace. Many have made the supreme sacrifice of their lives while performing these sacred duties. On this day, let us remember those martyrs and thank them. They have given up their today for our tomorrow. Remembering them and saluting their bravery is a way of saying thank you, of saying thank you to them. Our armed forces is perhaps one of the most credible institutions of our country and their unparalleled role in nation building is to be recognized, acknowledged and applauded. I am truly humbled and feel privileged to have been part of this wonderful armed forces fraternity and I am sure many of our my colleagues who have worn uniform have got the same emotions. As we look back as a country in our 76 years of post-independence journey, we have made great progress and India is demonstrated to the world that the Indians are second to none in all fields. The giant strides that we have made in the field of agriculture, aerospace research, missile technology, information technology, financial technology, banking, and overall development of roadways, highways, railways, higher education have been truly remarkable.